What's up, YouTube? It's Star Wolf. I've been sitting back thinking for a couple of days. Well, not a couple of days, but ever since the uh, Jada Pinkett and uh, August Alcina situation came to light. And just reviewing many stories, listening to Jada, observing her past, her character, and observing August Alcina and knowing about who Jada Pinker Smith's husband is and how they all get down, I came to the conclusion she's not she really don't want to do this red table talk. She really don't. She hasn't came out yet because she's trying to formulate and put together a well thought out lie. Something that she could sway the public with. I, I, I believe August Alcina. I believe him. But my reason for making this video is this. I also believe that it's possible August Alcina and Will Smith may have had sexual relations between the two of them. And this is something else that Jada doesn't want to get out. See, it's deeper than just Jada and August. Oh, she wouldn't really, man, believe me. For that to get out, for that to hit the tabloids, hit the media, Will Smith, Will Smith, someone of his character, not really his character, but someone of, of as prominent as he is in the acting community, in the entertainment industry, even though the majority of them is homosexuals. But if that was to get out, see, she don't want that to get out. And that's what I believe is going on here. He, I mean, the young boy ain't got no reason to lie. What does he have to benefit from this? What does he have? Is he heartbroken? So he want to sit up and make up stories and say, yeah, I was with her. She did me wrong. Or whatever the case may be. I don't believe that. I listened to it. And I listened to him. And I looked at him. I know you have to learn how to read people. Look them in the eyes. Look at their body language. Their movements. He not lying. But she. She's about to lie. Whenever she come out with that red table talk. She about to lie. And they probably trying to. They probably trying to pay him off right now. There's so much going on that. We can't see, you know, it's always things going on in the dark that eventually hit the light. Lately here, shit that's been in the dark ain't been in the dark too long. It ain't been no years and years and years. Shit that's been in the dark been coming to the light that same year or the next year or the next two or three months. Yeah, I think August, uh, August Alcina and Will Smith was sexing each other. And I think Jada was involved in it and sitting there watching and loving it. And I feel he had sex with Jada too. I feel he had sex with Jada first. And she brought him all the way on in to how they really get down in Hollywood. And introduced him to that other side of the world. And that's what really screwed him up. To be honest, to keep it all the way 100, that's why Will Smith is quiet. He don't want to talk. He don't want to say nothing. He don't want to open up a can of worms. Because once them can of worms is open, one lie going to lead to another lie. You got to keep covering up lies every week because people going to bombard you with questions question coming from this angle that angle that angle you ain't gonna be able to keep up with all them lies so he remaining quiet on the issue well i'm gonna just let my wife handle this 
Nah, any real man would stand up and be like, man, this dude done lied on me and lied on my wife. You ain't that busy. You ain't that preoccupied to where you don't know what's going on in the media and you don't know what's going on with your wife or this uh, August Alcina saying what he said. He remaining quiet because he know. He know. He can't say something that's... That that eventually he'll end up regretting. He don't want to stick his own foot in his mouth. Although he probably has something else in his mouth. And he enjoyed it. And he don't want that to get out because that's his real get down. So. Y'all let me know how y'all feel. Y'all let me know. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this situation. Because I know. It's a lot of y'all that listen to me, that pay attention, and y'all feel the same way I do. In fact, there's many people that's probably been speculating about that entire issue, and they've been leaning towards that. They just haven't spoke about it. Some people scared to speak about it. It's other artists, other people in the entertainment industry that really want to say something, but they scared. They scared they're going to lose their endorsements or they money to this, contracts to this or that, so they in control. So they, it's like they have an invisible gag order. They can't speak. They can't say nothing, you know? So don't nobody want to speak. Don't nobody want to speak out against the Smiths when everybody know they weird. Everybody know they been getting down uh, sexually. They been getting down weird for years. Look how they allow their children to be portrayed in the media. Even though there's many times you cannot really do anything because the media portrays everybody foul. But a lot of these things they allow to happen because they are a part of this agenda. They are a part of that. I don't care about none of that stuff Jada be talking about when she be speaking about black people and black power. And, you know, if Tupac was here and me and Tupac used to do this and do that. Okay, back then, all them many years, your mind, you was pure back then. You were solid. People change. People change overnight. So you talking about what you and Tupac used to talk about and do back in uh the early 90s this is 2020 that's almost like 30 years ago you've changed a great deal since then and did many things so i don't care i don't i don't listen to all that hoopla i don't listen to all that i look at people's actions and i look at how you treat your children and I look at what your children is doing. You allow your children to do stuff and then you claim it's, it's freedom. You have to allow them to be free. How free do you want your child to be when they being violated sexually and you're not saying nothing about it? That ain't freedom. That's, that's, that's pure fu uh, foolishness to me. Sound like you're going along with some type of agenda and you really don't care and you really can't speak out against it. And I'm really going to keep saying what I say. Because I mean what I say. And like I said. What type of man. Would even allow his woman. His wife. To even be disrespected by another man. You going to actually say that. And the world is looking at us. That I allowed you to have sex with my wife and I didn't care. Either it's true, that's why he ain't saying nothing. Or if he lying, something else went on. I'm telling you, he can't talk about it. He can't. That's why he can't say nothing. That's why he can't defend her. And August knows this. He got hard. He brave. Because these people, these people is wicked. They deal with a lot of other, other wicked people that's in the same lifestyle as them that, that,
parade around doing the exact same things every day with their own children. Start researching. Start looking up a lot of this stuff. And you will see how a lot of these people get down. Many things is being exposed and coming to the light right now as I speak. All the, adren uh, the adrenal chrome. The people that's been sex trafficking in kids, torturing kids, all these pedophiles, Epstein Island and all this. Just pay attention. They not, they not, uh, they not, they not saints. They not angels. Shit, you're not excluded from this. Anyway, I'm Star Wolf. Comment below. Let me know how you feel about this situation, what your thoughts is on this. Hit that subscribe and like button, that notification bell on the way out. Make sure that you share all my videos on all social media platforms. Peace.